Pleasant good morning. Welcome to Transverse Truck Trailer RV. My name is Marlon Bledman. And for all those tuning in for the first time, I'm one of the truck sales guys here in Transwest, in Frederick, sorry. Uh, again, for those coming in to Denver, we're only 30 minutes north of Denver. So very easy to get to us. We just off the I-25. And as you guys could see, all the traffic coming down this way. Um, today, um, for those, again, just tuning in and all those looking at Freightliners for the first time, we are the builders of the Summit Haulers. And behind me is a 2023 Summit Hauler conversion. Uh, this one is the M2 106. We do offer the 112s as well. Um, right now we are in the finishing stages of our first 2024 plus model 112. And that one is already sold to a customer. Um, and, but we do have a second one getting built right after that one. And that one will be available. So that one would be the only two for the year. Um, unless somebody special order one, which will be a 2025. Uh, so we're gonna walk around this uh, unit. This one was built a little bit different. We kind of did a different interior with this one. And I've, um, I know some of you guys have seen those before, but we have the tan interior in this one, which makes this a really, really beautiful truck, especially, you know, going out to shows and stuff and you wanna show off your truck. This one was built to show off. So from the first glance of it guys you guys can see how long this truck is uh, again uh, it's about 24 feet in length and again we'll uh, i will bring in a very very long uh measuring tape one in my next video and kind of show you guys the length of everything but again having this extra longer truck in terms of our competition, which has a 187 wheelbase, we build our trucks on a 197 wheelbase. So 10 inches is a little bit longer, but again, that gives you a little bit more of the bedroom, um, more storage uh, space down there. And of course, gives it a better look and give you more, again, when it comes to the bed, space on the truck with your trailer on there you do have that additional space near the headache rack to actually store more stuff but again with the, all the led um, lights throughout this truck give this truck a bright look at night um, so when that truck is coming down the freeway or the highway you could actually see it coming so again safety is the number one priority when it comes to owning a truck like this having that windshield that massive windshield up top again gives it that safety feature also but talking about the hood we have a massive hood here very easy to open and close so don't be intimidated the way it's designed but again when it comes to the hood and the front end feature as well we design the front end with a free piece grill plus a side vent as well so all this was added after the fact and again very very um, awesome look and doesn't like take too much out and just makes the front end looks really, really good again it does have that free piece bumper and for all those new to Freightliner if any piece of that bumper is damaged you can only replace that one piece so you don't have to replace the whole thing so that's a good thing to to put in mind or to keep in mind uh, we do have that summit hauler grill up here you have the option of actually adding um, changing up the grill and adding the lights to the grill so this area right here will become lights so if in case you do want to upgrade that again you could do it on a bill um, I do have some trucks coming in that already have those lights on there so kind of wait to see how that comes out but again uh, you could add lights to those grills for extra charge as well right now I got two straps one on either side very easy to open you do have a handle center of that hood and then underneath that hood, you have the Cummins 8.9 liter engine. Uh, it is the L9. Uh, it's also partnered with the Allison six speed automatic transmission. You're looking at 360 horsepower, 1,150 foot pounds of torque. Very, very beautiful combination. And again, with the hood closing on here, very, very easy. You got, you have that soft close. Look at that. You don't even have to touch it. But again, if you want to rush it you could just press down there and again guys you do have to strap both sides before heading down the road so feel free to do that before uh taking that truck down the freeway you don't want the hood open up opening up on you during that 
process. Again, tires, we have Michelin tires, 255 ADR 22.5s. We add all those nut covers and center caps, and we also put those auto balances on all four corners of this truck. Moving along here, this one is certified clean for all 50 states. So again, uh, you could drive this truck through all 50 states with no issues. Again, you do have your engine block heater over here. You have your trickle charger down here. And underneath this casing or door or area over here, you do have one of your 50 gallon tanks. And of course your depth tank, which is a six gallon on the 106s. Again, you could close that up, lock it up and protect your fuel. Let's take a first glance of the interior on the driver's side. You guys can see the tan seats with the brown roll throughout the interior. Again, you're looking at air ride front seats. They're also heated. Again, you do have the Summit Hauler logo on the headrest of this truck in brown stitching. Your key access point, right as you open up the door, so you could actually start this vehicle without having to step inside the vehicle. Again, you could actually also add remote start to those trucks, and it is set up where it is on a delay, where it will actually allow the vehicle to load. Like you turn the key, it will allow that vehicle to load, and then it will start up the truck. So yes, you can add remote start to those freight liners. We've done it a few times, so it is an option. Here on the door is our new panel. Again, you do have that Summit Hollow logo here with speakers on all four corners of the doors. When it comes to the 2024 Plus models, this will be changing up and the, the door panels will be a little bit different. But again, on the back seat here, you do have a back seat bench that turns into a bed. And again, it is DOT certified. And also you have charging, you have a couple of 110 plugins and of course four USB switches down there as well. Batteries are located underneath the back seat right here so you take off this casing right here you, you do have access to your batteries underneath that back seat. Again you do have storage throughout. Uh, this one does come in for airline chuck as you guys can see all the real estate you have in there for storage. And of course you have that truck for your airline. And of course, this truck does come equipped with an air hose. It is all weather stripping. And of course you could lock it up to protect your personal items. Dual wheels in the back. The auto balancers are between those two wheels in the back here. More storage down here. And again, it's all lockable, all four storage boxes. All right, this one is equipped with a BMW turnover ball hitch. Right now, you do see some holes in the plate here. And again, if you wanna change that out to a Hensley trailer saver hitch, we can do that with this system. All we have to do is just remove that ball and install that airbag hitch. Again, you do have your seven pin hookup here for your trailer. You have your Voyager camera system input here. So if in case you do have that system on your trailer or you want to set that up on your trailer, you could actually do that. And then we'll send the feed to the separate screen we have up front. You do have a 15,000 pound bumper pull hitch. And of course the same storage on this side, headache rack, fully diamond plated bed. And of course we have one camera up top here for your rear view. Right now we're gonna take a look inside. Uh, one thing about Summit Hauler, uh, those trucks we do come with fully air brakes and it does have the air drum. Um, it doesn't have the pads, disc. This one come with the air drum, um, air ride seats, air ride cab, air ride rear suspension. And we haven't shown you a video in a while where we dumped the rear air, so um, hopefully in my next video I will be able to do that. Right now I start the truck. Very, very quiet. And a lot of people have this 
uh, question about the, the noise coming in and out of this truck. Um, nowadays, they've been building those trucks, you know, without having all that air coming in or noise coming in. So again, it's a good way to come in, test drive those trucks and kind of feel that and hear it for yourself. Um, again, one of the things that we do here at TransWest is that we go through a PDI process when that vehicle comes in. Even though it's a brand new unit, we do send it for our shop. We make sure that, you know, there's no leaks, there's no recalls. Uh, we add the auto balancers, all the nut covers and center caps. Um, we do a alignment check. We go through the whole process of making sure that vehicle is ready for the road. Um, again, the dash is all curved. Again, like I said in my previous videos, they will be getting away from the curved dash. It will, it's going to be a flat dash from the 2024 plus models. So again, this is the best time to grab one of those uh, curved dashes as they last. We have a few on our lot right now. So don't hesitate, come on down, grab one of those before you know they get rid of that curved dash. So here, down here we have your engine brake um, switches. Both of those two switches are for your engine brake. Over here you have your Allison six-speed automatic transmission, reverse, neutral, and drive. Again, for all those who don't know, once the vehicle is in, in neutral and your parking brake is up, you are in park. You have your cruise control up here. Those two switches up here is your cruise control. Over here is your intermittent macro lights. You have your manual region button. Traction control coming down here is your uh, switch for your red differential lock. Just gonna make sure the in here circulating is going on. Uh, down here you got four USB chargers. Um, this is only for charging. Down here is a USB for your Apple and Android to go into your screen. Uh, the driver has four switches here for the two front windows and the two back windows. You got heated mirrors, you got your locks, you got your red dumb switch for your red suspension your lightest button and your optional switch. When it comes to the lightest button, that's an option where you could plug your trailer in, when you ready to go down the road, you could test all your lights on your truck and trailer to make sure everything is working. So you trigger that, your AC, if your AC or heat is running, it will kind of, uh, kind of die down. Your stereo will go off, you will hit this countdown. It's almost like a 10 second countdown, enough time for you to go out and start walking around your truck. Once you hear the sound, right after that sound, all your lights on your truck and trailer, if you are hooked up, will be blinking. So you will make sure all your lights work before heading down. Once you're done with that walk around, you can come back in here and press that light switch button one more time. Everything will come back to life. Your stereo will come back on. Your AC will start back running whatever uh, speed you at. Um, and then everything will come back to life again. All the blinking will stop and you know all your lights are working or which ones are not working, you could mark them up and make sure you fix it on your next stop or even before you leave. Your trailer brake is down here. We do we deal with the Red Arc. Very easy, very out of the way, very small um, feature here. Uh, you do have your um, sub knob. So you have, do have a subwoofer underneath the back seat and this knob is to increase your sub or your base. You do have your in air, your cab um, AC and heat, and then you have your red AC and heat over here. The blue is for AC, the red is for heat. Right next to it here is the fan levels. You have a high, medium, and low. And of course, this is equipped, like I said earlier, fully air brakes. And then you also have an air brake supply for your trailer if your trailer does have air brakes. So when it comes to the Red Arc, you have your electric and hydraulic over here and then you have your air brakes up here so this truck is fully equipped for that cup holders nice storage compartment in here and we do have a hidden cup holder for your passenger up front up here you do have your voyager camera system right next to it here is your string here for your air horns you have your regular cd horn down here and of course we're going back up here with storage. So we got storage throughout up here 
again you have your switches up here this one is for reading lights it will turn on those two front lights and of course you have a mood light here that will actually give you that infinity light and I call it which kind of really really nice ambience at nighttime really really cool feature I really like that a lot okay so a brand new 2023 you do have all your warranty on this unit uh, you have your two-year on the engine bump, um, drivetrain then you have your five-year on the on the transmission on the Allison transmission and you also have a three-year 36 on your conversion so whichever one comes first uh, this one will be equipped with that so when it comes to the stereo everything that's got uh, the conversion comes with uh, you let us know what's happening you call us and then we will um, file that under warranty so in the meantime guys now uh, like I said we're only 30 minutes from Denver International Airport very easy to get to us if in case you need a shuttle to bring you here we could pick you up from the airport during working hours uh, we do offer trades we do take in trades we do offer long-term financing in a personal name and short well regular term on a business name so you guys could call us and we'll tell you what those terms are uh, again we do offer delivery throughout the United States so if you do have a trade that needs to come back to us we could deliver the truck to you and bring the trade back again they will have a cost to that uh, transaction but again if you just if you don't have a trade and you just want to deliver to you we can get that delivered to you as well so great options here at transfer St. Frederick with our summit haulers we got a few colors in stock so look at our website call me or Larry Vickers we will definitely uh, point you guys in the right direction we got some really awesome deals going on right now so give us a call choose your color choose your design choose your seats with heat cool massage tan black um, so we do have those options as well so if you guys have any questions feel free to reach out to me my number is at the bottom of the screen with my email definitely reach out and ask any questions underneath the comment slot below but in the meantime thank you guys for tuning in and thank you for choosing summit hall